Hey guys, um, I finally got around to doing the lemongrass and I wanted to show you a couple of bars of how it turned out. lemongrass and then today I am making fierce mail um, lighting is not good there we go it's from nature's garden um, it's supposed to smell like the fierce cologne from Abercrombie I believe hopefully it smells close it's pretty good and I'm going to be using a, a black swirl in my base so I'm going to go ahead and my oils and lye are already cool so I'm going to go ahead and mix those together I've been trying to use the whisk more and less of the stick blender just to see how it works and I've been having pretty good success with it. So I start out using the whisk and then I stick blend it just, just a little bit just to get it emulsified. to get too many air bubbles in it. It's pretty close match to Abercrombie. Smells really good. just to get it nice and warm 
and then I'm going to pour this in and then I'm going to put it back in the oven and force it to gel because I really like it when they gel. I, I don't prefer non-gelled. And it's just a personal preference, you know, whatever you like. If you don't like to gel, I mean, you don't have to, but personally, I like to. Okay, I'm going to stick my blender, and I'm going to pour some in my cup first. Get that blended up. I'm going to pour one cup in there. Get it mixed up. And this is just my basic olive oil, coconut oil, palm oil, and castor oil recipe. It works really well for me. I like how it turns out. It's very consistent makes a nice hard bar. This works really well for me. And if you want, you know, this specific recipe, I can post it, you know, if somebody wants it. into this um, I don't want this to be so thin that the black just goes straight through I want it to kind of make layers in the base soap here so it's coming along it should be good preheated it. go 
all the way to the bottom, so I'm going to hold it up high. Pour it in the middle. Or try to. tomorrow.